everyone, it's Jason Wang, and I'm back in Taiwan this time to take part of the Spend a Night in the Presidential Office Building event. I've already visited the facilities, but now I'm at the Caesar Park Hotel because I want to create a special treat for the guests, international influencers who are coming for this event later this year. ideas for my sweet treat for the event guests later this year. I'm here at the Caesar Park Hotel and I'm meeting executive chef Ah Kang Lee. Hello! And I know that like me, you're also not originally from Taiwan. So where are you visiting from originally? Okay. And what do you think about uh, some of the flavors that uh, you think are representative of Taiwan? Fruit, fruit, yeah. Yeah, pineapple and the mugwa, papaya, yeah, guava. I love passion fruit. Yes, yeah. yeah. And And lowly, avocado. So lots of great delicious fruits. Um, and I love that about Taiwanese. Oh, perfect, because I see you have all these ingredients here. So, Chef, what have you been working on? Can you show us um, what, what it is? Oh, wow. Beautiful. So can you tell us this is what is it? Oh, wow, 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 wow. Okay. Okay. So, and I see you've garnished with some sesame seeds, so yeah. there is uh, pepper in this um, caramel filling and also beautifully caramelized hazelnuts. So I think white pepper is an ingredient that's used in a lot of savory cuisine. But I think it's definitely something very unusual to put it in, in a sweet dish. So. Okay, so let's take a look. Beautiful. And I know, especially with the humidity in Taiwan, it's not easy to make caramel. So I'm gonna try this. Mm. The sourness from the raspberry really makes everything taste so good. Mm. I like, you know me, I like sour. After tasting this delicious dessert, and after what we discussed, I have some ideas for some flavors I might wanna use in a sweet treat for the guests coming for the event. So, uh, is it all right if I use your kitchen for a little bit? Okay, one chi Okay, ah. great. So let's get cooking. time to create something amazing for the guests and I'm going to be working with some of the flavors I think are iconic to Taiwan and uh, plum powder, a little sour, salty, got some dried long an and the hospitable pineapple, symbol of hospitality and fruit, amazing fruits, passion fruit, so fragrant and aromatic. But, uh, let's see what I come up with. For this very special event where there are people coming from all over the world, I wanted to design a sweet trio that really represents some of the flavors that I've grown to love about Taiwan. So first item, a chocolate bar. I've created white pepper toffee, which is embedded in the dark chocolate, and there's dried long yen and black sesame, and also some watermelon seeds. White pepper, you'll see it in almost all of the savory dishes, and I thought, what would be a great way to combine that into something sweet? Well, toffee, a little sweet, salty chocolate, a nice combination. The second item is a beautifully piped flower shaped cookie filled with passion fruit. Passion fruit is one of the signature fruits of Taiwan. Taiwanese fruits are just so delicious, so amazing. So a fresh, bright, acidic filling and a nice crunchy shortbread cookie decorated with a little bit of pink amaranth which is local to the area. And to round it out, the iconic 
pineapple cake. So this is something that everyone comes to Taiwan and everyone will buy and take home. But my version has a little bit of lime in there to brighten it up and I don't like too sweet. So a little bit of lime zest to cut the sweetness of the very delicious Taiwanese pineapple. A little plum powder in the dough to give it a little extra zing. And that rounds out the beautiful trio I have for the guests coming. And I hope everyone will enjoy this postcard of Taiwanese flavors. Chef, I Hi. have completed my dessert, and I'm wondering if you could try some and give me some feedback or some ideas. So this is the pineapple cake, a chocolate bar, and also a cookies with passion fruit filling. So, wow, it's very beautiful. Oh, thank you, thank you. Yes. Okay. Mm. Mm. Yeah, I put some salt in there, yeah. I think ah. Taiwanese people, they don't like super sweet, right? <laughs> I mean, I like sour, but... Um, I'm trying to represent some Taiwan flavors, and I know not too sweet. So. Mm. And this is the chocolate bar. Okay. And the chocolate bar, I put some white pepper in the toffee candy that's mixed in the chocolate bar. So it should have a little spicy. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Cooking is my way of exploring the world, and after having the amazing opportunity to spend one night in the presidential office building, this is my sweet postcard for you of Taiwan's iconic flavors and spirit. I hope you'll take advantage of this amazing hospitality and hope to see you soon. Jeff, thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Secretary General Lin, it's Jason Wang. Yeah, welcome. Welcome here. Thank you for having me. It's nice to meet you. Yeah. So I visited the presidential mm. office building mm. and I got some inspiration to mm. design some desserts for the guests who are coming later this year. Mm. This one is uh, a version of my feng li su mm. pineapple, pineapple cake. This one is chocolate, but mm. there is uh, white pepper, bai hu jiao, tai fei tang in there, toffee mm. in there. But mm. this one I made a cookie. Mm. Uh, it has a fruit filling, mm. but I'm wondering if you might try it and can you guess what the fruit flavor is? Yeah. Okay, please help mm. yourself. Yeah. Let me try it. Mm. And can you guess what the mm. filling is in there? I used a fruit. Is this passion fruit? Passion fruit, yeah. Wow, yeah, yeah. yeah. And yeah. Do, you, do you like passion fruit in general? It tastes very good. Okay. Yeah. I think it's a really special fruit in Taiwan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think mm. you should also try the pineapple cake. I'm yeah. curious what you think. Yeah. Yeah. So it's a little bit different, mm. but I used a little lime in the filling with the pineapple, so... This is Texture. Yeah, texture. Mm. I enjoy it. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so I think it tastes okay, because if it were bad, you wouldn't finish it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think it's a little mm. different with the lime juice in there. So mm. I wanted to do something special for the mm. guests. Yeah. yeah. Now, Jason, as you probably know, you are our first guest this year. Thank you for having me. I, I really enjoyed it. And uh, we are currently looking for more guests to join us. Submissions are open until June 30th. And we all hope to see you all very soon. And thanks for flying all the way just to be here. Oh, my Jason. pleasure. My pleasure. <laughs> The office of the president of Taiwan is always open to the people and open to the world. Mm. So please don't hesitate to do it again. Okay, thank you so much. I yeah. really appreciate it. <laughs> A pleasure. Yeah, we'll hope to see you soon. Or should I take it? Yeah, one? please leave it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Enjoy, yeah. <laughs>